Come, come with me. Come, friends. I'm going to need you to suspend disbelief for a second here as we go on this tour. Hi, I'm Misha Collins, and I'm playing Harvey Dent slash Two-Face on a new show that you are aware of because you're watching this. It's called Gotham Nights. And what I'm doing is a little show and tell, which is kind of exciting. Look around. A bunch of thieves turned fugitives. Joker's delusional daughter. A sidekick. Batman's orphan. Anybody want to give me a crash course on being vigilante? I would like to point out a few things to you, which is I get excited about, even though I've been doing this for a long time. On the other side of these beautiful, wavy glass windows, uh, is my office. It's Harvey Dent's office. The walls are, are only three inches thick. They're very lightweight. They would not weather a hurricane. This is also the Gotham City Police Department, the GCPD headquarters. Is this gonna ruin watching television for people? Are people gonna be like, I'm not gonna watch TV anymore. All that stuff is fake. I feel bad about this, actually. Okay, so this is GCPD headquarters. Here we have Commissioner Soto's office. I will have um, many scenes in this office over the course of the season. Here we have the Gotham City Police Department insignia. There's a little peppering throughout all of the sets on Gotham Knights of Easter eggs uh, related to the mythology. Um, our, our chief nemesi are the Court of Owls in this season. And here you see this little figurine of owls. And that is something that might cause enough anxiety that you would have indigestion. So we also have this here. One of the things that's really cool about this entire universe that's been created is that we have an amalgamation of different time periods in the, the look and the feel and the set decoration and even the wardrobe that we're deploying in the show um, is because the Batman universe is a timeless universe that spans many decades and has actually been a part of the psyche of generations of fans. And so that all shows up in this new world that is its own world, that is Gotham Knights. And there's one more little pearl over here, which is the mail cart. If you make it to episode two, you'll see why this is so disturbing. Okay, so I'd like to invite you into my office. I also, just as an aside, one day hope to have an office like this myself. This is the anteroom to my office, my assistant's sprawling and beautiful office. And then if you'll follow me this way, this is my office. Many seating areas, beautiful chandeliers, incredible art deco design, and a lot of little thoughtful details, like because I'm ultimately going to be two-faced, you can see that there are duplicates of many things here, very subtly referencing um, that inner divide. Our set decorators, art department, prop department, so good on this show. It, everything looks so beautiful. I plan to steal a lot of things from this production. And this is my desk. This is the desk of Harvey Dent. I'll make a little admission here. Uh, the first scene that we shot in here, I sat here and made somebody take a picture of that and realized that I was actually starting to get full of myself just because I was playing Harvey Dent. Um, there's a little, little bit of an ego check moment here. I got very excited sitting at this desk for the first time. And this phone, I think, is a great illustration of what we were talking about, about this sort of anachronistic uh, technology. It's, this is a mashup of early 20th century communications technology and late 20th century with the push buttons. That's my tour. Thanks for coming along for the ride. It's so great to have you on board for our little adventure here.